Do you want to get a USA visa in 2023 for F, J, M, H, L or the B1, B2 category? Then this video is a detailed step-by-step -step guide on how you can do this with some special techniques for booking the slots. Keep on watching. Hi guys, my name is Shachi and I'm a travel and a visa coach. On this channel, you'll find lots of useful videos on the US visa process. We have playlists for all of these visa categories, so make sure to check it out. Today's video is going to be a detailed step-by-step -step guide on how you can get a USA visa in the year 2023. Now, this is going to consist of three steps. Step number one is to book an appointment. Step number two, fill a detailed form called the DS-160 form. And step number three, to clear a one-to-one -one interview with the visa officer. So keep your notes handy because we are going to go into detail of each of these steps and there's a lot of information coming your way. So let's get started. So let's start with step one and step one is to get a USA visa appointment. Now in India, the USA visa appointment consists of two dates. One is a biometric and one is a consular interview. So you will need to log into the CGI Federal website. This is a website that you can see on my screen right now. Log in here, enter your email ID, set up a password and create your account here. Once you create the account and pay the visa fees, you will be able to book these two appointments. Now here's what has changed in the year 2023. Most of the appointments that you will see on the CGI Federal website will be for the year 24 or the year 25, which is not feasible if you are a student, a working professional or a parent looking to visit your son or daughter in the US. Now, for the year 2023, appointments have been releasing every now and then, but they are released very randomly. There is no specific day or no specific time of the day when these appointments are released. It is released every now and then and the only way to catch these appointments is to track and monitor the system really regularly and diligently. So you'll have to set up a schedule of tracking the system and make sure that you log in the correct number of times of day because if you exceed the number of logins, you also have the risk of getting blocked from the system. So here I want to share with you a simple solution for the entire tracking and monitoring problem and that is to use the website easyslotbooking.com. So easyslotbooking.com will monitor the CGI Federal portal and whenever slots are released, they are going to track that and inform you in real time about the release of the slots. So this way you are saved the entire hassle of continuously tracking and monitoring the system, which I think is the most frustrating part in the entire process. And since you're informed in almost real time about the availability of slots, your chances of getting a visa slot increase all the more. And they have separate updates for people with fresh profile and people with a refused profile. So easy slot booking is going to help both of these categories. So let's see how to use easyslotbooking.com. It's a very simple process. And in three steps, you will be able to book your USA visa appointment. So let's see how to do that. So for the first step, you need your phone and download the Telegram app on your phone. I'm sure all of you know about the Telegram app. So download the Telegram app and check the link in the description box. This is the website link for easy slot booking. So click on the link there and create your profile. So creating your profile is a simple one-time process. You need to enter your name, your email ID, phone number, and select the visa category which you're looking for. So from the drop-down box, select the visa category that you are applying for. So you can see that there is F, J, H, L, M and B1, B2 categories available. So you can select whichever visa category you need from the drop-down box and set up your account. So for step two, once my account is set up, I'm going to get an email with the list of Telegram channels to join. And since I selected the student category, I have my Telegram channels for the student group. According to the visa category that you select, you will get your own list of Telegram channels. So join the important channel because this is where you will get update about the interview location and depending upon the biometric location that you're looking for, you can join any of the biometric channels. I know that there are a lot of Telegram groups out there, but most of them have tons of members in it. We don't know whether the information in that is verified or genuine. Whereas the Telegram groups of easy slot booking are closed private groups. There are limited number of people in it and the information here is genuine. It's 100% verified. So you can really, really benefit from the updates that you get on these channels. Now for the third step, all I have to do is to wait for an alert from the Telegram channels that I have joined. So the Telegram channel will send you an alert whenever a slot opens. Remember these alerts are real time, so you need to act quick. 
So you'll see that the alert looks something like this. So it will very clearly show you the embassy location, the interview location, the number of slots available and also the dates for which these slots are available. It also shows you whether it is for a fresh or a previously refused candidate. So as soon as you see an alert which is relevant to you, quickly log in to the CJI portal and book your appointment. I have seen a lot of people use the Easy Slot Booking website and on an average they are able to get an appointment in about one to one and a half month. So definitely do give this a try. As a bonus, Easy Slot Booking also gives you 24-7 customer support. So if you are stuck anywhere in the process or you just want more information about the trends and the pattern of slots opening, then do reach out to their customer support ID. The link for that is in the description box. So if you're still here, still watching the video, do give this a thumbs up and let me know in the comment section below. Uh, the first 10 people to do this are going to get free access to the Easy Slot Booking website. So comment down below, hi Shachi, it's me and we will send you a coupon code giving you access to the Easy Slot Booking website. Now that we have our appointment, let's go to the next step and that is to fill our DS-160 form. Now DS-160 form is a detailed 6 to 7 page form which is required to be submitted before you do your biometrics. And this is the only form that is asked in the entire US visa process and this is the form that the visa officer will have in front of him when you go for the interview. So filling the DS-160 form accurately and completely is very very important. So take care to do that. Most of the information in the DS-160 form is factual, so you just have to be really thorough in entering the dates, the numbers, the addresses, and take special care while filling two sections. One is the travel section, because this is where the visa officer gets an idea about your intent of stay in the US. So the travel section has to be filled very carefully. And the second section to fill really carefully is the work and education section. So the visa officer rarely asks for your resume or any other document from you but he will read the work and education section of the DS-160 form. So especially for those of you going for a student visa or a work visa like H or L, the work and education section is the most important part of the form. So we have two dedicated videos, one on general guidelines for filling the DS-160 form and the second video on how to fill the work and education section of the DS-160 form. So do check out these two videos and they will give you a more clear picture on how to take care of your form. And now coming to the third and the final step, that is the interview. So this is where all the hard work has to be done. So you need to clear a one-to-one -one interview with the visa officer to finally get your USA visa in the year 2023. And these interviews are normally a two to three minute discussion where the questions asked generally revolve around the purpose of your visit to the US, how are you going to be funding your trip and what are your reasons to come back. Now, depending upon the visa category that you're applying for, these will take specific type of questions. For example, for F category, you'll be asked, why do you want to study this course in the US? For L category and H category, you will be asked, what is your role in US and why you have been selected for that role? And for the B1, B2 category, you will be asked, what is the purpose of your visit? Why do you want to visit US for tourism? Or why do you want to visit US for the business purpose? So we have dedicated playlists for each of the three categories and this will give you a much more thorough prep because honestly this is a process which requires preparation. So do check out these playlists. We also have question banks. So we have separate question banks for student visas, for work visas and for the tourist visas. So do check the link in the description box below and get your hands on these question banks. They are free PDFs which are going to help you prepare. So these are the three steps to getting your USA visa in 2023. I know this video has a lot of information but I really hope that this helps you and gets you started on this process. It would be great to see more and more of you getting your USA visas in 2023 and finally traveling to the US. If you have any more questions, feel free to leave this in the comment section below. You can also DM me on Instagram. My Instagram handle is at shachi.mal. Be happy to answer all your questions. And yes, do check all the links in the description box below because there are a ton of information out there. You can also work one-to-one -one with me. So if you want to work with me to prepare for your interview, to get help in filling your DS-160 form and in taking mock interviews, we have all of these options available. So all these good stuff is there in the description box. Please do take a look. Signing off for now, we have more useful content coming up on the USA Visa series, especially dedicated for the year 2023. So make sure that you subscribe and stay tuned and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.